हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई वेलकम यू इन लेक्चर नंबर सेवन ऑन फर्स्ट ऑर्डर ऑर्डिनरी डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस सो फार वी हैव डिस्कस्ड ओनली वन मेथड फॉर सॉल्विंग फर्स्ट ऑर्डर ऑर्डिनरी डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस एंड द मेथड वाज वेरिएबल सेपरेबल मेथड और इफ आवर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इज सेपरेबल देन हाउ टू सॉल्व दैट टाइप ऑफ डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस Today we are going to discuss another type of first order differential equations known as exact differential equations. So in this lecture we will see what is meaning of exact differential equation and we will discuss how to decide that given differential equation is exact or not. Before that uh, we recall from mathematics 1 or calculus that if we have function of two variables say u x y uh, which has continuous first order partial derivatives then differential of u is denoted by du and is given by partial derivative of u with respect to x into dx plus partial derivative of u with respect to y into dy so this this is known as differential of u so we will remember this is required to define exact differential equation if u is a function of two variables then this is known as differential of u and is given by del u by del x dx plus del u by del y dy now we understand what is meaning of exact differential equation so suppose Uh, we want to check whether given differential equation is exact or not then first we have to write our equation in this form some function of xy dx plus some another function of xy say n dy equal to 0 so every differential equation of first order and first degree can always be written in this form so if we want to define exact differential equation uh, first we write our differential equation in this form dx into function of xy which we have denoted by capital m dy into function of xy which we have denoted by capital n now this differential equation is exact if there exist some function of xy which we denote by u such that differential of u is nothing but this left hand side that is m dx plus n dy and we have discussed what is du du is nothing but differential of u which is given by del u by del x d x plus del u by del y dy so differential equation 1 is exact if there exist a function of xy say u such that differential of u equal to m dx plus n dy if we can find out some function of xy such that differential of that function is nothing but left hand side of equation 1 which is m dx plus n dy then this u is called uh, this uh, differential equation one is called exact differential equation and this u will give us the uh, general solution now suppose differential equation is exact then uh, we obtain that du equal to m dx plus n dy so if we replace m dx plus n dy by du then we have du equal to 0 and if we integrate this uh, we obtain u equal to constant so if we can determine this function u then uh, we see that du equal to 0 gives us u equal to constant and this is nothing but general solution so if we can determine this function u then general solution of equation 1 can be obtained directly by integrating du equal to 0 with respect to u and we obtain that u equal to constant 
is the general solution of equation one. So now we uh, see some examples in which we are able to find out this function u and uh, uh, we will see the conditions that how to determine whether this type of function exists or not. So uh, we have written all these things systematically. First we have written the meaning of differential of a function of two variables. So if u x y has continuous partial derivatives then its differential is given by this formula du equal to del u by del x dx plus del u by del y dy. So if this function exists then uh, if uh, du equal to this then if we consider du equal to 0 then its solution is nothing but u equal to constant. For example, suppose we consider this function u equal to x plus x square y cube. So if we differentiate u with respect to x, we consider y as constant, derivative of x is 1, y cube is constant, derivative of x square is 2x. So this is del u by del x. If we differentiate with respect to y, x is constant. So derivative of this x is 0, y, uh, x square is constant, derivative of y cube is 3y square. So therefore, total differential of this function is du equal to del u by del x dx plus del u by del y dy and we substitute values of del u by del x and del u by del y. So this is du equal to this. So this is the total differential of function u. So now if we consider du equal to 0, then we will obtain the differential equation. So this is the differential equation which is obtained by taking du equal to 0 and du equal to 0 gives us u equal to constant. So the solution of this differential equation which we can rewrite in this form also is nothing but u equal to x plus x square y cube equal to constant. So this differential equation is exit because du equal to this left hand side and because it is exit, uh, we can directly find out its general solution simply by integrating du equal to 0 with respect to u and we obtain u equal to constant. So uh, we have written definition of exit differential equation, a first order differential equation of the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0 is called an exit differential equation if there exists a function u such that this left hand side m dx plus n dy is nothing but du du is nothing but total differential of u so this equation is exit if there exists a function of two variables say u x y such that differential of u equal to left hand side of this equation which is mxy dx plus nxy dy equal to 0 and du is nothing but del u by del x dx plus del u by del y dy. So this uh, differential equation is exit differential equation so we have to find out a function such that we have to find out a function u such that du equal to this left hand side y square dx plus 2xy dy. So if we consider u equal to xy square and we find out del u by del x. So del u by del x is y square constant derivative of x is 1. Del u by del y is x as it is derivative of y square is y. So therefore du equal to now du is given by del u by del x dx plus del u by del y dy so therefore del u by del x is y square dx plus 2xy dy and this is nothing but left hand side of given differential equation y square dx plus 2xy dy so this function works here. If we take u equal to x y square, 
then this left hand side is nothing but differential of u so there exists a function u equal to x y square such that du equal to this quantity y square dx plus 2xy dy so therefore this differential equation is an exit differential equation now if our differential equation is exit then it is not easy to decide this type of function such that du equal to this left hand side so every time it is not easy to guess this type of function that if our differential equation say m dx plus n dy if we want to check whether this differential equation is exit or not then the question is how to check whether there exists a function u such that du equal to m dx plus n dy every time it is not easy to check by trial and error uh, how to decide that whether this type of function exists such that its differential is m dx plus n dy so some another working rule is required to check whether this differential equation is exit or not so now we are discussing the condition under which this differential equation is exit that means we discuss the condition such that using that condition we can decide whether there exist a function u such that differential of u equal to m dx plus n dy so that is known as necessary and sufficient condition for a differential equation of first order of the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0 to be exit so this differential equation is exit if partial derivative of coefficient of dx that is m so if we consider coefficient of dx we differentiate it with respect to y and if we consider coefficient of dy we differentiate it with respect to x so if these two partial derivatives are equal then this differential equation is always exit that is there exists a function du such that m dx plus n dy there exists a function u such that du equal to m dx plus n dy if this condition is satisfied so the differential equation of the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0 is exit if del m by del y equal to del n by del x or partial derivative of coefficient of dx with respect to y equal to partial derivative of coefficient of dy with respect to x we will differentiate coefficient of dx with respect to y we will differentiate coefficient of dy with respect to x if both the partial derivatives are same or equal the differential equation is exit and if partial derivatives are not equal differential equation is not exit because it is necessary and sufficient condition so differential equation is exit if and only if this condition is satisfied so this will help us to check whether given differential equation is exit or not and so that we can apply the appropriate method if our differential equation is exit then we have ready made formula to find out its general solution so this is very helpful condition uh, we can consider for this differential equation suppose we want to check whether this is exit or not then we first compare given equation uh, with say m dx plus n dy equal to 0 uh, we see that m equal to minus y x raised to minus 2 and capital n is x raised to minus 1 so now we differentiate capital m with respect to y so this uh, minus x raised to minus 2 is constant and derivative of y is 1 
and if we differentiate capital N with respect to x here we consider minus 1 times x raised to minus 1 minus 1 so we can see both are equal del m by del y equal to del n by del x both are equal so therefore because both the partial derivatives are exit sorry are equal given equation is exit differential equation we check for this one uh, we don't have to write m and n but we first write our differential equation in this form something into dx plus something into dy equal to 0 uh, we must take this quantity on this side because our condition is applicable to this type of form if our differential equation is in this form then we apply that condition so first we should take care that if our differential equation is not in this form we should convert it in this form and now we can compare with m dx plus n dy equal to 0 or uh, we can directly check we will differentiate coefficient of dx with respect to y so i differentiate 3 into y plus 1 with respect to y so 3 constant derivative of y is 1 and here 0 so derivative of coefficient of dx with respect to y is 3 now we differentiate coefficient of dy with respect to x coefficient of dy is minus 2x so here derivative is minus 2 so we can see both are different so therefore given equation is not exact so this condition is very helpful to check whether differential equation is exact or not so to check whether given differential equation is exact or not uh, we will first check whether given equation is in this form or not if it is not in this form first we convert it in this form and after this uh, we remember in this way we differentiate coefficient of dx with respect to y we differentiate coefficient of dy with respect to x and if both are equal then this equation is exact differential equation so this is all about this uh, session in the next uh, lecture or session uh, we will see how to find out general solution of exact differential equation so i hope you like this thank you very much